like art and particularly drawing has just always been a part of my life. It's not even something that I even really thought about. It was just totally normal. The first memory I have would be from preschool, actually, with a whole bunch of colorful felt markers. I remember we were given paper plates that we could draw onto. Any kids usually interested in using a whole bunch of different colors. And I just did a series of circles to make kind of like a tree ring. Throughout my childhood, I was mostly using pencils and pens to draw. That probably has affected me in terms of actually really honing in on my drawing skills, like just being able to kind of finesse that control over a pencil or a pen, since I've been working with those two things for such a long time. I generally work with very detailed pen and ink drawings, and then I use my X-Acto knife to cut out shapes from the paper. I use Liquitex inks a lot to make really vibrant, colorful ink washes. Part of what I love about working with them is that it's very organic. One color will start to mingle with another color, and you just have to kind of let go and be open to chance. I think I must have been in about grade seven, and we were given the assignment of making a book. I think that that's kind of interesting now, since I've actually illustrated and published a children's book, to see that that's been part of my process, and it was a dream of mine for a long time. I continue to be inspired by very similar things. I actually do have some drawings that my parents have kept from my childhood, and a lot of them are very similar themes of of birds and other animals. So nature has always been an inspiration for me and it just, it continues on. This one's me.